What's going on, guys? It's one Maximum RPM coming at you with another video today. Uh, and this is going to be an end of the year kind of rewind. Um, last year for New Year's, I said goodbye to the white gloves, and I said hello to the yellow ones. Well, this year I said goodbye to the yellow gloves fairly early on. This year. I said goodbye to a couple things. I said goodbye to my old phone, uh, which was an S4. I had that for three years. I was glad to get rid of that. But one thing that I wish I could have back that I had to say goodbye to was uh, Kira. And I love you very much, Kira. Um, I'm going to keep... Uh, on my YouTube journey for you. Um. So. A lot happened this year actually. Um. I ended up getting. A couple RC cars. Um. Which I'm very. Thankful and grateful for. Um. I finished my stadium finally. Um. I just, uh, I got my first motorcycle, uh, I got my permits, um, for both car and motorcycle, and I have learned a couple things medically that I wish I hadn't though, but we're not gonna get into that. Overall, it has been a solid year, um... 2019 I've enjoyed a lot I'd say it's probably been one of my best years I've just had an overall good time uh, but there was one or two moments where I would quite like to wish never happened um but the show must continue and uh I'm just going to take those as part, all I can do is take it as part of life and keep going. Um, I'm interested to know what 2020 has in store for me. Um, and I'm looking forward to, uh, enter 2020 with all my friends and the friends that I've made on YouTube. Whatever happens with the whole Copa deal on YouTube will happen. Um, this channel will always continue. Um, I plan on starting a second channel for my four-wheelers. It'll be like more RPM or whatever. But that way, if RC does fall under the Copa laws... Um, then I can't get in trouble for that, and I can still do my four-wheeler and airsoft and other random shenanigans along with my, um, uh, cars and motorcycles and stuff, because I'm, I'm a car guy, so, um, but yeah, I've, 2019 has been a fairly enjoyable year, um, and I've been, I'm just overall thankful for a lot. I came into my first 3D printed Beyblade. Thank you so much, Quake and Bacon. It means so much to me. And he helped, he helped me fix the problems with it. Um, I don't have a very good understanding on how to design, how to design things, but he's making it so. I have to go through a rite of passage in ways for me to move forward, which I do appreciate. Um, because it really has helped challenge me to become a better person in general. I like challenges. Um, but, um, I'm grateful for many things. I'm grateful for my parents. I'm grateful for my family. I'm great mo grateful for all of you guys. Um, and, yeah, 2019 has been a pretty good year. And I hope in 2020 to see a couple things. 
people being better people to each other, people having better days and a better year, fewer fake Beyblades, um, fewer medical problems in general, um, and just an overall better year, um, I plan on doing the best that I can for another year, um, I had a couple issues with people, um, I had one issue with someone throughout the entire year, but it became a problem towards the end, uh, but you know what, we over, I'm overcoming obstacles, and I'm meeting new people every day, um, YouTube has been an experience that I'm really taking a lot from, and, uh, I, I take a lot from it, but I'm trying to give back, um, and I do have a couple giveaways planned before Beyblade has completely run its course. I am going to uh, do a giveaway. And I plan on doing an RC giveaway eventually. <clears throat> but yeah, guys. I'm, I'm just thankful for everything. And uh, thanks, guys, for a great year. And, uh, here's, here's to another good year. Um, hopefully YouTube will get off of our backs a little bit, change a couple things around, maybe. Maybe, uh, change some of the problems that I see with the Coppola. I mean, I'm, I'm glad that they're doing it to help protect the children and everything. I just hope that they can find a better way to do it where it doesn't affect everyone. Um, the way that youtubers themselves are being effective but you know at the end of the day we'll work with what we have and uh yeah so um i'm super grateful guys um and i hope you guys have all had a great year as well um it's uh it's been a great year couple big um, accomplishments have obviously been the, uh, getting the new, uh, a couple new RC cars, uh, new wheels, upgrades, um, finishing my stadium, finally getting a tripod, moving away from my old setup, sorry about all the wires guys, but that's what I used to run with, um, I worked really hard on this stadium, and it's gotten me quite a bit of, uh, love and attention i find um ooh, that's on my bixby button i don't want to randomly start turning on things my new phone is this bixby thing how like there's like apple watch and whatever and all that bull crap samsung has bixby i don't know how it works so i don't even throw it around with it but whatever um <clears throat> but yeah guys um i keep my white gloves in a treasure box and here here they are well, there's one of them. The other one's still in there, but I'm still hanging on to these old things. They've, uh, they, they mean a lot to me, and I just want to say thank you to everyone who's helped me out. Um, a couple shout-outs to Ben from Buy Break, I Fix It, Johnny Reigns, Customer C, Honey Lulu, and Wayne Kibler, um, Steve OD313, uh, Big Papa Paul RC11, Charlie RC, um, Big Air RC, uh, Star Raptor Flock, Spike, um, Quake and Bacon, Instaburst, um, and a thousand others that I don't have time to mention. But thank you guys for everything that you've done. It's meant a lot to me. Um, and here's to the new year. And just remember, guys, V is coming back, and he's going to be better than ever. I'm actually thinking, I'm considering buying a Takara Tomy set. I'm thinking about getting the original Minoboros so I can have a Quake driver for Uppercut. Did I just call it Apricot? Uppercut, I'm so sorry. If I called it Apricot, I'm so sorry, Quake. I didn't mean to call your Beyblade a food. <laughs> um, But yeah, guys, I'm looking forward to what the new year has in store and i'm going to be graduating in two years if everything goes smooth so 2022 we should expect an increase in videos or i don't know 
we'll figure something out, guys. What the future has in store, no one knows. Um, when, when my journey will end, nobody knows. But I'm going to enjoy it while I can, and I think the rest of you guys should as well. And I hope you guys have a great year, and I hope that the year that you have had has been equally as good. So, that's about it, guys. Um, <coughs> please like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the bell notification so you get all my videos because I upload daily. Um, and as always, I hope that this video makes your day just a little bit better. Live life to the max and stay awesome. And have a great 2020, guys. I'll see you around.